fashion, art, club, entertainment. This is what FACE stands for, and that is what makes FACE Runaway the best fashion event in LA. As we start preparing for next season's fashion show, we want to take you on a journey from casting calls to the fashion show and show you, the viewers, what a day in the life of a model, fashion designer and face runaway fashion show is all about. So let's begin our journey. Face runaway casting audition process is different from the regular fashion show you're accustomed to. FACE gives chances to all types and all kinds of models with the designer's specific request for certain looks. When models come to the audition, they immediately start the photo shoot. Models have to do a few poses on camera in a short period of time, and this is a great way to see who is confident and comfortable in front of the camera. After the photo shoot, the models introduce themselves. Then the catwalk audition begins. Zedra Coleman, ready to model for face. My name is Eliza Ovenchain, and I am here to show the world my face. My name is Tavana Moore, and I'm here to model. My name is Eric Stewart, I'm here to model for Face Fashion Show. My name is Treasure Cooper, and I'm here to model. My name is Langston Crush, and I'm just here to be seen. Hi, my name is Jessica Rogan, and I'm here to work the runway. There you go. Hi, my name is Corey Ag, and I'm here to model. Hi, my name is Victoria, and I'm here for model. Hey guys, so now that you've met all of our gorgeous and sexy models, we can move on to the really exciting part of the competition, where they all strut their stuff down the catwalk and show us what they've got. Are you all excited? <laughs> Three things here. One, can the model walk with confidence and with flair? Two, how the models pose at the end of the runway. Three, does the model have what the designers are looking for? Don't wanna wonder, I'ma ask for your number. I was hoping I can call you sometime. But if I don't speak, then I might be asleep. But I'm hoping you would stay on the line. And you may think right before you lay sleep Chase me, take me, place me in the front of your memories In the front of your memory Careful discussions from the judges, we announce which models we want to invite for the rehearsal. So we're finishing up this round of auditions. Everybody did such a great job! Woo! Everybody's so excited and we loved watching all of you guys do your walk. So now it is decision making time. All right, so I'm back here with Dwight, and we are going to have a few of our models uh, do one more walk for us. And I believe Dwight is going to be orchestrating this part. Uh, correct, correct. Male models, you guys are going to come here, hold, and then you guys are going to go to the inner line. You guys got that? Yeah. All right, all right, all right. I'm just going to have to stop you guys right there. I hate 
hate to be the bearer of the best worst news that you've ever heard, but you guys have actually made it to the next round. to the casting audition. I see some really, really good faces here and I'm hoping to see you guys at the fashion show. You guys ready for the audition? Yeah! Hi everyone, I'm Danielle McBride, host of Face Runway. You can feel the energy. We're live right now in Los Angeles uh, with Face Runway. I'm with Dwight. Tell us what you're gonna be doing today. All right, you guys, my name is Dwight. I am the fashion show coordinator for Face. Briefly, what I'm gonna go through to make sure that everyone get a fair shot as a model for the Face Fashion Show. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? I want to feel the energy. Woo! Let's have the casting begin. My name is Alina Shelestuk. I'm here for Face Run by Walking. My name is Dale Moss, and I'm here to walk for Face Running. My name is Kyla Ashley, and I walk for Face Running. We invite 100 to 200 models to the audition, depending on the designer's look request. Not all designers always look for the typical 5 foot 9 size 0 models. Since the majority of women are average 5 foot 4, size 4 and above, FACE gives the models a chance to follow their dreams and also look good which appeals to the general public. My name is Michael Patico and I'm here to walk the FACE runway. My name is Nicholas McInerney, and I'm here to walk the face runway. My name is Michael Smith, and I'm here to walk the face runway. My name is Dillard O'Green, and I'm here to walk the face runway. Hello, my name is Bria Fleming, and I'm here to walk the face runway. My name is Jordan Nash, and I'm here to walk the face runway. Runway casting has just wrapped. You all did so good. It was so fun to see everyone. Um, so right now we're going to make our final announcement. So when Dwight says you're a uh, number, please move to the side. Good luck to you each. If your number is called, please go ahead and step to the side and you will be escorted outside. If your number is not called, please stick inside and then we'll go ahead and discuss some pre some information with you guys. You guys ready? Yeah. Yes. All right. Can we have number seven come on down? Number 122. Sometimes we call out the models who made it, but sometimes we call out the models who didn't make it. Every casting audition we do it differently, so most models don't have a clue if they made it or not until the last minute. Tiffany, I am one of the modeling coaches and we are here to give the models a second chance. Let's see how it goes. All right, you guys ready? Woo! All right, now I'm gonna start with my female models first. Go ahead and walk by and then come back and go ahead and walk back, okay? Then male models, you will follow the female models, walk and then come back. You guys got that? You guys go ahead and go back. Go, go ahead. All of you guys that have just walked for us, go ahead and stand back in line. Um, I don't know. What do you think? Mm, no, I'm really not too sure. Mm. 
My name is Alina Shilistyuk, I'm from Ukraine, I'm 24 years old. It's actually my first time for modeling, it, is, it will be so exciting for me, and, but I like stage and I feel that I can give a positive vibration for all the viewers. My name is Eliza Obenchains, um, I've actually done quite a few shows, uh, I've been modeling for about seven years now, uh, I did some modeling in college and then moved to LA and have been going since then. Dale Moss. Nice to meet you, Dale. By the way, you have very nice eyes. <laughs> I appreciate so, it. So, how did you feel about joining Face and finding out that you were picked? Uh, you know, I was excited. Uh, the whole process was a little bit nerve-wracking for me. It's something completely different than I've done before, uh, but it's something I wanted to do. So, uh, you know, I showed up, uh, tried to walk as clean as possible and uh, just have fun with it. Hey, what's up? Kevin John here, back for Face Runway. And I am back. No, it is not Shamar Moore or Tyson Beckford, but it's not that far off. I am joined by Joel and Michael. Now, speaking of Tyson Beckford, Joel, the last person said he actually looks like Tyson Beckford. How do you feel about that? I don't know. I mean, everybody wants to be like Mike and everybody has that person they want to be like. Yeah. I personally feel like I look like Tyson. But. Lucky to be sitting in between both Katie and Julia. That what would you say uh, inspired you to get into modeling? We'll start with you, Katie. Okay, I would say um, the uh, ability to be someone else, to act, to uh, be fierce, and just have that confidence. It's an opportunity, you know, and also to wear pretty clothes. Like I think human beings are God's greatest creation, and to kind of show that off is is what we, we're here to do, basically. That's very true, because God loves models. Hi, I'm Danielle McBride, host of Face Runway. So excited right now, because I'm here with one of the performers for the fashion show, November 1st. Um, please introduce yourself. Uh, my name is Cameo. I am a singer-songwriter. I perform, I dance. Great, and how did you hear about Face? Actually, a friend of mine that I know from like years ago um, presented the opportunity for me to come and perform, so just was fate. Awesome. Yeah. And then, do you usually perform by yourself? Do you have like backup dancers, or do you have? T tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, I mean, um, it just really depends on what type of performance I'm having. I mean, I've sang, you know, like the national anthem, that's just me, you know. Or sometimes when it's like a full performance, like a big show, yeah, I'll have dancers. Like for this show, I'll have dancers. You know? Okay, yeah, tell us, what are you going to do for Face Runway? I mean, this is this is cool. I want to uh, hear it. Can I, get well, the, can I get the tips right now? Well, no, that's a secret. You got to stay tuned to watch. Oh, okay. Got to stay tuned, I guess. Anyway, on set right now with another one of the performers. So excited. Please introduce yourself. Hey, I'm Stereo Lisa. Stereo Lisa, what a cool name. Thanks. Awesome. So tell us, what type of performer are you? Well, I'm an urban uh, electro house um, artist, and I also write and perform my, my own songs and I... And you're going to be with us at Face Runway, right? Exciting. Exciting. <laughs> so tell us a little bit. Can you tell, give us some hints? At least tell me um, any songs we can look forward to hearing or... Oh, sure. Uh, we just released uh, another single that's it's called uh, Set My Heart on Fire. Oh, I like that. And uh, the music video is just hilarious. It was um, made in the, in the style of Neo Noir. Anyway, so excited right now because I'm here with a platinum selling artist. Can you please introduce yourself to us? Sure, hi, my name is Manu and I'm from Switzerland originally and uh, I was a Disney artist over there. So that's when, you know, we sold kind of a couple of records, <laughs> but now I'm over here. So Awesome, can I just say I love your outfit, it is so cool. <laughs> and out for the fashion show and what you want to perform. Well, I heard I'll be performing um, basically on the runway and then at the after party. So for the runway, I thought I'm going to bring my violin player and my guitar player so we can go nuts. And at the after show, actually a full band. Because I do pop music, but I'm very much of a rock performer. Like I go, you know, I go crazy. Do you, so, do you have any some hit songs that maybe I know? Uh, you might know the song that we did back home in Europe. It's the one that goes na 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 na. I love that song. I'm so excited to meet you. That's so cool. So fun to have you, and fun to be on set with you. And I'm excited for the fashion show. So thanks for being with us. 
here at American Bozzy with Rachel. Thanks for having us. Thanks for having me. First off, the name, how cool is that? Yeah, people get usually like confused whether if it's like Italian or Korean. We actually have a Korean uh, definition at their bottom, but then Bozzy means uh, denim in Korean. Yeah, our line actually, we've had the basic denim line for over 15 years. Uh, we just started going towards fashion about two years ago just because people were looking for fashion so much that just regular denim got boring and then people wanted something more out of it. So nowadays we have a lot of it as a wash or any kind of style of fashion that's in denim. So it's quite interesting. Um, so James is the designer, correct? Yes, and he's he is. always been part of Gates Runway. Yes, he's actually. We've actually been to a fashion show every um, every year. We're always there twice a year. So excited to be with Andrew, the designer of Victorious, where we're at right now, the showroom. So Andrew, tell us a little bit about your brand. Um, we're at 1506 South Los Angeles Street in Los Angeles downtown fashion district, and uh, we do uh, men's clothing and. Uh, Hip hop urban wear for young men, urban hip hop, whoever can pull up our Victoria's brand. Great, and so is that what you specifically focus on? Is like more hip hop, like urban? Urban for young men, yes, that's what we're focusing on. www.victoriousla.com. Awesome. You guys can check out our website all the time. Great, and then we're so excited to have you again back for yes. the Face Runway. I know you've been there a couple years, so. Yes. Um, yeah, times. it's gonna be great. And we're here today to talk with you guys about your line. Uh, My name is Elaine from downtown Los Angeles. <laughs> um, this is my line, ENLA Swimwear. I'm the designer of ENLA Swimwear. And I'm 25 years old. I've wanted to design ever since I was pretty much back in college. I've always loved art and I've always loved swimwear. So ENLA Swimwear is more about misty contemporary swimwear. And it's geared towards women ages 35 and up and we carry plus sizes and it's all made in the USA and you can find us on www.enlaswimwear.com. This particular top is for women who want to feel sexy and comfortable at the beach and this is more for a woman who wants to cover more but be as comfortable and be as as uh, stylish as possible and this is just something that has more coverage. We have the bottoms that covers that's more. That's great, that's great. You know, got a little cushion under the cushion. I mean, that would be nice yeah, exactly. to have on. <laughs> it's all something that you can mix and match. We do sell it in separates, so you could always mix and match whatever swimsuit top and swimsuit bottom you want. So excited to be in the showroom right now. I'm in Lonnie handbags, hanging out with my co-host, Nicole Shipley. She's clearly having too much fun. Um, I wish I was shopping right now. Um, you can check out Lonnie handbags at LonnieStyle.com, and you can also check out their social media at Lonnie handbags. Also, some cool facts, uh, some of the celebrities featured with their handbags who are obsessed are Nikki Reed, Pamela Anderson, and so many more. Um, Nicole, are you shopping right now? Because I'm jealous. <laughs> I'm just picking a few things up, you know, maybe to take home. Um, I want that. Because I think like this would look so cute. Yes, with my outfit, I'm obsessed already. Nicole, how fun is it that we're surrounded by all these amazing purses? I want to take every single one of them. I know. <laughs> Don't you love this one? It's so cute. I love the brown and like the bejeweled, bedazzled. Yeah, do you know that they're featured on PeopleStyleWatch.com, uh, Phone Magazine, and even Rock? Wow, it's crazy. Well, I mean, I'm not surprised. They're amazing. They're so cute. Hi, this is Tiffany again with Face Runway, uh, interviewing Shy Fan. Pleasure sitting next to you. I mean, you look so recognizable. Oh, Can you just tell us a little bit about yourself? Um, yes, um, a lot of people might know me. I'm on the current season of America's Next Top Model, Cycle 21. Yes. <laughs> yeah, my, I'm get recognized by my hair. So okay. It's kind of a big thing. Um, I'm actually starting to pull the line. It's called Sandbox 405. So I will be presenting it for the first time November 1st at the fashion show. So you'll get to see my stuff. Is that the current project that you're working on? Yeah, I'm an artist as well. So oh, nice. everything that's like in incorporated in my uh, clothing line it's all original artwork so everything that you'll see like on my clothes or hats or whatever I'm going to be putting out there it's all original artwork whether it's from me or other artists that I collaborate with. Speaking of your brand where can I find your brand I mean I definitely want to check it out. Yeah um, you can find me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook it's Sandbox405. Um, 405 represents where I came from which is Oklahoma so go check it out I just launched a website www.sandbox405.com 
Um, also follow me on Twitter and Instagram at shy, S-H-E-I underscore P. And just, you know, see what I got going on because I got some great things in store for everyone, I promise. That's <laughs> awesome. No, and I'm so excited. Check her out. How's it going? My name is Colin Smith, Operations Manager for Defiant Clothing. Talk about your brand, your clothing. I, I hear actually celebrities wear them. Yes, uh, Defiant, we are based out of Riverside, California. We work with everyone from Justin Bieber to Snoop Dogg. We actually just partnered wow. with Andre Drummond, Center for the Detroit Pistons. He's our new brand ambassador. Yes, we're actually uh, we're, we're expanding our brand into um, women's and children. Uh, we're hopefully opening our storefront in 2015, so we're very looking forward to that. Oh wow, I'm excited, and maybe I can check it out since you're coming out with women's clothing, so that's great. How can people find out about your brand? Well, Defiant, we are worldwide from Puerto Rico to Japan to from New York to California. You can also find us online at www.dfynt.com. And you hear that, that's where you can find the brand, which I'm definitely going to check it out. Tiffany with Face Runway, I'm actually here behind the scenes checking out the models. They're doing their last and final walk before the fashion show, which is actually November 1st, right around the corner. So let's actually go ahead and take a peek and check out to see the walk Finally, the day has come, the Face Runway Fashion Show. Face Runway team is ready. Models are ready. People are here to see the best fashion show in Los Angeles from our incredible designers. Sometime. But if I don't speak, then I might be asleep But I'm hoping you would stay on the line And you may think right before you lay sleep Chase me, take me, place me in the front of your memories In the front of your memory Huh, and here I go But if I don't speak, then I might be asleep But I'm hoping you would stay on the line And you may think right before you lay sleep Chase me, take me, place me in the front of your Memories In the front of your memory I can 
can call you sometime But if I don't speak then I might be asleep But I'm hoping you would stay on the line And you may think right before you lay sleep Chase me, take me, place me in the front of your memory In the front of your memory Carry on, it's hard to break free from this 